Hey guys, I'm Yoshi King from Y2K and JJ. Today I'm going to be showing you the basic field strip of a 1911 style pistol. Now, most 1911s will strip the same if they're a high end replica, uh, but other than that, you don't really want to be taking it apart if it's not a high end replica anyway. So, to watch out for safety is the number one thing here. So, no matter what you're doing with the gun, make sure the magazine is out and make sure that it's not loaded at all. So if you check in the barrel, uh, then you shouldn't see any BB in there at all. If there is, just give it a little whack and it should fall out pretty easy. So this is the WE1911 High Kappa 5.1. People have told me it's a special edition, but either way. Also featuring on this gun is the Gemtech Outback 2 silencer, which is a brilliant silencer for any pistol. Not really recommended for Rifles, I have tried on my VF, VFC M4, but it's it's just too small. So if you want to get a silencer for a rifle, definitely go with a with a nice scar scar light or scar heavy type of silencer because they look great on an M4. Either way, let's get into the field strip. So you can take off the silencer because this is an unnecessary part. And you can just load that somewhere else. So you you've got the pistol down and you're wondering what to do next there's a little pin in here that's called the slide stop this is the slide stop here now if you can see there is a little you can see that there's a little little notch there which you need to pull the slide back to so you, if you can see right there the slide stop is uh, just exposed the top of the pin is just exposed when you have it on the tiniest notch so you want to pop it right out the back by this little pin here. You just pop that out. It should come out pretty easy. So if you're wondering, oh gee, your gun's beaten up a little bit, I, I play airsoft, and when I play airsoft, I get into it. So, you know, your guns are going to get scratched up a little bit. But mine's always cleaned and always oiled, which is another important thing of taking care of a pistol. But that's another video. So you've taken out the slide stop. Now you pull the slide forward. Just like that, easy peasy. Just slide it forward to, and you just put this chassis down. You don't need that anymore, it's fine. Now, if you look at this, this is delicate. There's, a, there's always a spring in the blowback pistols. Remove that, just pull the spring guide out a little bit, slide the spring out just like that. Then pop this little piece out. There we go. And now you'll have this little barrel retainer maybe, and you just slide that out, and then once you've got nothing left to pull out, just slide that barrel out, and there you have it, there's the barrel. So that's the, uh, that's the basic strip of the 1911, now to put it back together you're wondering, we have all these pieces out here, what you're going to have to worry about now, this is the last step. We want to take care of these guys here. So, if you just grab, you slide again. Grab your barrel. This is the outer barrel and inner barrel. You don't want to strip them down anymore unless you're changing it over. But you slide that in like that, <coughs> no worries. Take the barrel retainer and you just chuck her in there. And there we go, no worries. Alright, now take the spring and the spring guide and you want to feed the this, this end of the spring that's not caught by the spring guide into the tube which, oops, which goes straight where this guy is. So, take this end, just slide it down there, no worries, and then just push that there and there you have it, no worries. Take the spring, push, in, push it in that little tubing there, and just <coughs> feed it until it stops there. Now, I was confused when I first took apart the pistol when the spring is just, it, it just doesn't seem like it should. It's very wobbly, and there's nothing to retain this piece, it's just just slotted there and it's held there but of course when you put the slide on it's fine again so 
make sure this little piece is notched in and if it's not just slide it out here it'll be like this so just push this little piece in here and you should hear a click there we go easy peasy now take the bottle body and the slide all you need to do is slide it on back there make sure the spring is good look at that good good stuff take the slide stop here and insert it just the way you took it out finding the little notch and the pin on the top of the slide stop and push it in all the way there you have it it's good to go that is the field strip of the 1911 styled airsoft gun if you guys want to see a more detailed field strip um, you can just PM me on YouTube and I'll be happy to show you how to strip down all these mechanisms in here and uh, and all of the safety and the grip safety um, takedown. Alright, well thank you very much for watching. Please rate and subscribe.